Hi friends, welcome to Read Aloud Today. My name is Miss Cindy, and today the book we are reading is called When Spring Comes. Remember, we're learning about our new season of spring. It starts with an S, like a snake, spring. And this book was written by Kevin Henkes and illustrated by Laura Dronzak. Illustrated, that means she is the one that colored and drew all of these pictures, the beautiful illustrations. When spring comes. Oh, look, on the first page I see umbrellas and flowers and bees. Lots of things to do in springtime. Before spring comes, the trees look like black sticks against the sky. Look, there's no leaves on those trees. What season is this before spring? It's winter time and it's very cold outside. But if you wait, spring will bring leaves and blossoms. <gasps> Look, this was different from before. Here, the trees didn't have any leaves on them. And on this page, they have blossoms and leaves. Blossoms are like little flowers before they start to grow and bloom. If you wait, spring will make the leftover mounds of snow smaller and smaller. What's happening? And smaller, they're melting until suddenly the snow is gone. Look, the bird's looking like, where did the snow go? It melted from the sun and the warm air. Before spring comes, the grass is brown. But if you wait, spring will turn it green and add little flowers. Look at those pretty little flowers in the grass. So this is before spring, and this is when spring comes. If you wait, an egg will become a... Who's coming out of the egg? A little bird. And if you wait, a seed will start growing. What is it growing into? A pink, beautiful flower. Spring comes with sun and it comes with rain. And more rain. And more rain. Springtime we get a lot of rain, but it makes the pretty flowers grow so beautifully. But look, this bird I see something else happening in these pictures. This bird is making its nest, and then it looks like she's laying on the nest. I see a little tiny hint of blue there. And if you look at the next page, you can see it again. But here, what's different? I see the baby birds. Maybe that blue part was the eggs of the baby birds, and Mama was keeping them warm. Do you like mud? Do you like puddles? I hope you like umbrellas because in springtime there's a lot of mud and puddles and you're going to need an umbrella to stay dry. Some people wear raincoats and rain boots in the springtime too. What animal do you see on this page? Do you see an elephant? Do you see a giraffe? Do you see a cat? Do you see a dog? I see a dog. I see a little white dog. Can you find him? There's the little white dog and he has brown spots. Before spring comes, the garden is just dirt and empty. But if you wait, Spring will push green shoots through the dirt to fill up the garden. <gasps> Look at that bunny. The bunny is eating the garden. That's not good. Look, these pictures show what they're growing. I don't know if you can see that. They're really tiny. Looks like they're growing carrots. And spring will call out the pussy willows and new kittens too. Look, this plant is called a pussy willow. They're really pretty and they're very, very soft. Look at the baby kittens. Oh, what's the kitten playing with? It looks like a little ladybug. Spring can come quickly or slowly, and it changes its mind a lot. 
You know, the other day I was looking outside. It's springtime, but I saw snow coming from the sky. Just a little, little tiny bit of snow. But I said, it's springtime. Why is it snowing? Sometimes it changes its mind and the weather will get cold again. But when spring is finally here to stay, you will know it. And there will be buds and bees and boots and bubbles. Ooh, that's a lot of words that sound with a start with a sound B. B, B. Buds and bees and boots and bubbles. Can you think of another word that starts with that sound? B, B, B. Ball. B, B, B. Balloon. B, B, B. Book. Blue. There's lots of words that start with that sound. There will be worms and wings and wind and wheels. Ooh, there's another sound, a W sound. W -w -w. Worms and wings, like flapping on the bird and the butterflies. And wind and wheels. There's wheels on the wheelbarrow and wheels on a bike. Can you think of another word that starts with that sound? W -w -w. Whale. W -w -w. Water. See if you can come up with some more. You will feel spring. You will smell spring. And you will hear spring. Hmm. Think about how can you feel spring? A lot of times in springtime it's really, really what outside? It's really windy. You can feel spring. How can you smell spring? I'll give you a hint. How can you smell spring? You can smell the flowers that grow in springtime. And what might you hear in spring? My window was open earlier and I could hear birds outside singing. They are going <laughs> You can hear spring, you can hear the birds chirping. When spring is finally here to stay, you might think you are done waiting. But you're not. What, what else do we have to wait for? Now you have to wait for summer. So remember our seasons, we started with fall when the leaves fell from the trees and they, after they changed colors. And then we had winter where it got very, very cold outside and we had snow. And now we're learning about spring where the flowers grow and baby birds and kittens are born and the weather gets warmer. And then it will be summer where it's very, very hot outside. And the, the flowers go away, but then the green grass and the green leaves grow. And after summer, it's gonna be fall again. It's gonna repeat itself all over again. Thank you for reading When Spring Comes With Me, and we'll see you next time. Bye.